CBS 58 Hometowns Winter Edition is heading to the water. We're taking a look at ice fishing here in the Milwaukee County area. Today we're learning about a local fish farm helping to keep some of our lakes stocked. CBS 58's Frankie Jupiter joins us on ice. Hey guys, Frankie Jupiter here, and I am geared up, I'm layered up, I've got my mittens on. We're here at the Summerfest Lagoon where folks are doing a little bit of ice fishing. So join us. Let's jump on in. My name is Aaron Schiller. I work for the Wisconsin DNR. I'm a fisheries biologist. We're out on the Summerfest Lagoon. Ice fishing is exciting. Uh, to get into it takes a little bit of effort. In this location, it's, it's really good for uh, decompression, especially being in Milwaukee. We're surrounded by the city, but it's pretty quiet. We were just over the, the rocks there looking at a whole bunch of birds out there, big boat coming through, but it's, it doesn't feel like you're in the middle of Milwaukee. So it's, it's relaxing for me, I think for the anglers. Megan Gross, beginner farmer. We are in Franklin at the Hunger Task Force Fish Hatchery and Farm. We grow uh, 500,000 pounds of vegetables. That is our main focus uh, every season. Uh, we bring in about 5,000 volunteers every season to help us do that work. Um, and part of our lease from Milwaukee County is to run our county fish hatchery. Milwaukee County Parks, the uh, ponds are considered, considered urban waters uh, and they're heavily fished uh, throughout the entire year by uh, people and families in the Milwaukee County community. And a lot of people rely on those fish to feed their families. They've done it for several decades now and they continue to do so. So we are there to stock the fish so they have something to fish for. The biggest hope is for them to teach their kids how to fish and then continue that uh, tradition of fishing, either ice fishing or um, fishing throughout the whole entire year. From a fish farm that helps to stock some of our local lakes and ponds to ice fishing, it's a great way to be outdoors in the winter. Reporting for 58 Hometowns Winter Edition, I'm Frankie Jupiter. Ice fishing is our focus on 58 Hometowns this week, and while the weather, of course, may not be great for it right now, we've got a lot of winter weather to go. Yeah, CBS 58's Frankie Jupiter went out early this week to give us a look at a popular ice, ice fishing spot. Hey guys, Frankie Jupiter here for your CBS 58 Hometowns Winter Edition. I'm over here at the Summerfest Lagoon, but I want to pan, I want you to pan down if you could. Oh yeah, this is, this is very much standing on a frozen body of water, but here with me is Aaron Schiller. He is a biologist with the Wisconsin DNR. Uh, first of all, hello, how's it going? Good, good, beautiful day. Yeah. Talk to me a little bit about, we see folks here behind us, uh, they're in their tents, they're ice fishing. Yeah, I have a couple guys out today, um, <clears throat> ice fishing for brown trout and steelhead. Uh, beautiful day and, and uh, hopefully they get, catch one soon. <laughs> Absolutely, what do folks need to know when they first start out, you know, wanting to get into ice fishing? Yeah, ice safety is a big thing. Um, you know, no ice is ever safe, but there are some some things, some steps you can take to, to check the ice and to be sure that you're going to be safe when you're on the ice. So that's number one. And then number two, you know, there's a lot of, lot of gear and a lot of fish out there. So dialing that in and being on top of the fish is important as well. Make sure you have a good time. And what can one do to get into, are there classes to get into uh, kind of the mindset of ice fishing and getting to know all about it? There are some uh, fishing clinics coming up soon here. So February 11th, there's some in Milwaukee. Um, those are kids fishing clinics, but they'll really welcome anybody from the public if you're interested in learning how to fish. And it's not just for the kids too. They welcome the parents to come along um, and learn what, uh, what we have available in, in Milwaukee and, and elsewhere uh, if you're looking to get into ice fishing. And what's that excitement like being out here on the, um, on ice fishing? Uh, it's fantastic when you're catching them, and even when you're not catching them on a beautiful day like today, it's it's very enjoyable. Awesome, awesome. Aaron, thank you so much. Uh, listen, folks, this is a first for me. I've never been on a frozen body of water, but I'll send it back to you for our CBS 58 Hometowns Winter Edition Ice Fishing.